Hello, it's Brian Resney, Resney Wealth Management. It's question and answer day. Two questions that have come up a lot, continue to about oil and gas and demand, and do we still like oil and gas? And the other one is really about a digital currency, not only in the U.S., a central uh, currency, but also around the world. Let me hit the oil and gas first. Yes, we ultimately see if we stay within these uh, supply and demand uh, constraints and with the current administration and the on fossil fuels, we see higher energy prices across the board. Of course, if they change their tune and they become more friendly to fossil fuels, which we're going to need for the rest of the century, realistically or longer, um, we'll change our thesis. So we're watching these things day by day, of course, and we'll make adjustments as necessary. But yes, we still own oil and gas, and we're very happy that we do. But we bought these over two, two and a half years ago within our client portfolio. We've made position changes and actually increased positions and added to when we have little dips in the overall uh, oil and gas market, and we get a little bit better valuation. But again, daily research, looking at the constraint, uh, supply demand constraints, and looking at really ultimately what the administration is gonna do. So yes, we still enjoy oil and gas investments within our managed accounts. The other big question I've had a lot as of late is about digital currency. Is the U.S. gonna have a digital currency and is, are they doing this to spy on, on you and basically curtail what you can spend money on? You know what, I'm not a big conspiracy theorist, but I will say every country in the world, and there's already some that have real digital currencies that they're in utilizing. Digital currencies, yes, one day will probably, every country will have one, and it will replace a paper dollar or the coins in your pocket. It's gonna happen. Is it a way for the government to control you? That's a decision you have to make. But ultimately, what the government is trying to do essentially is getting rid of transactions and really be able to track transactions probably better, whether you like it or not. And a lot of transactions that are done with cash, of course, as we probably all know, often come from people that are not doing very good things, people that are breaking the law, like drug dealers and things of that nature. So would a digital currency be able to better track and, and apprehend these people? It sure could. So there's pluses and minuses to everything, but ultimately a digital currency is not bad, it's not necessarily good, it's basically a way for you to pay. And if you have a smartphone, which most people do today, you already have digital currency on your phone. You've got Apple Pay, you might have a credit card on there, you can just scan, boom. That's digital pay. All those things are recorded. Everything can be brought up. These things can be tracked already. So ultimately, if you're really concerned about a digital currency, then most people should never be on any social media at all. If you go on the internet at all, if you're on any social media, Everything you do, every keystroke you hit is tracked, analyzed, and then you get a pop-up ad. Or they know you're driving through a state, and all of a sudden you'll get something on your phone about an upcoming uh, restaurant or a hotel. So again, you're already being tracked, maybe not by the government, but certainly by technology. So just kind of remember that. This is going on for years already, but most people never think about that. They only hear about propaganda in the news, and then assume that the government's coming for your money. We don't believe that's true. If you're not a client of Resident Wealth Management, you're tired of bad client communication, bad, bad investment management in general, or the conflicts of Wall Street banks and insurance companies, give Resident Wealth Management a call. Call us, discuss our money management. We'd like to get you back on track. As always, real money management, real advice is what we provide all of our clients. Have a safe and profitable day.